Good afternoon, everyone. This is Eric, Northwest Bus Sales. Thank you for your time. All right, uh, check this one out. We got kind of a little mini coach looking thing right here. This is a 2006 El Dorado. It's called an REA. Now, the REA stands for Rear Engine Automatic. <laughs> I'm not sure. I just made up that automatic part. Anyways, I'm not sure what the A stands for. So anybody listening out there, let me know what you figure out on that A, what that stands for in the REA. So this is like a little mini coach right here for Eldorado. So it's a 2006 Eldorado. It's on a Freightliner chassis, rear engine, plug style entry doors you come in. It's got kind of, you know, with that plug style entry door, it kind of reminds me of a crystal or even like a Van Hool, you know? So check out the step treads as you come in. Looking pretty good. This thing doesn't have a lot of doggone miles on it, so step treads are in really good shape. Oh, check this out. Yeah. Little fuse box in there and what have you. Yeah. Oh, yeah. All right, check out. The floor's in pretty good shape. Also, driver's seat upholstery's in really good shape. There we go. Oh, is that Soundgarden? Yeah. All right. And also, AM, FM radio right there. Cassette player. How about it? Thermo King driver and passenger heat and AC tilt telescoping wheel it's got a lot of coach features look at these big windows you know what windshields are looking like they're in pretty good shape you know what it's got a window up top there kind of like an e-model man a lot of reminiscent of a coach you know what? so over here the missile switch is right there retarder on and off switch I don't know if the retarder works power mirrors and heated mirrors and then kneeling feature also. Let's check out that kneeling feature right here. How about it? See that? You see her going down? Mm-hmm. See that? And then this middle missile switch. Oh, see you shut it and it goes back up this middle switch right here. Well, that's uh, ejector seat. So uh, just kidding, totally made that up as well. And then normal control switches over here. High idle, driver, passenger, heat and AC, video system, open and close the door. Also, Allison automatic shift pad right there. I, it, I'm i not sure, but this might be an Allison B300. Don't hold me to that now, but that's what I'm gonna, that's what I reckon it is. 106,000 miles, see that? 106, 213. Yep, child's play on an 8.3 liter Cummins engine, so. Looking pretty good, you know, fire extinguisher down there. Grab bars, you come in, and then also, Friedman high back passenger seats. I fell on black days. And then also, uh, let's see, aisle and uh, both, man, armrests on both sides of the, of, the, of the coach seats right there, aisle side and on the exterior side as well. So reclining high back passenger seats, no less, with uh, no footrest. <laughs> kind of a pump fake right there for you. So, but it does have map pockets right there ribbed aisleway uh, carpet underneath the seats there looking pretty good you know it overhead parcel racks and I point that out emergency roof hatch right there row of five here in the back it's a 33 passenger so as you can see it's got well you, I, I, you know I was monkeying with the with the video system I couldn't get it all the TVs working there's about four out of the six working but if that's something that you're you require well shoot I know my shop can get the window or the video system going see that overhead parcel racks courtesy lighting there's the thermo king right up there roof mounted AC system and then uh, big tour style windows that are tinted also PA system how about it all right six flip down monitors all right, I think that'll do it on the inside. Let's cruise around it outside right quick. Let's check out the tire tread. Try not to take up too much of your time. See that decent amount of tread there. Good undercarriage here. Air tanks underneath there. I reckon those air tanks are for the door and also the kneeling capability on this baby. New exterior paint, blacked out windows. Look at it. Paints and tip shot, tip top. The body is in good condition as well. So. There we go, see that pass-through under floor storage. Mm-hmm, good tire tread down here. How about it, she's knee-deep in tread. Nice set of mud and snows on the back end there. Check her out underneath here now. There we 
go. All right, I'm going to show you this rear luggage area. That noise you're hearing, if I'm not mistaken, that's the AC compressor. I'm not sure what's going on there. So check out this massive, I mean, oh, dude, check this out. Massive rear luggage area that you should walk into, courtesy lighting. You know what? Look at this. Shoot, they even got AC vents back in here for the keep your luggage cool. Not sure what's up with that. Oh, a little fan here as well. See this here? Cargo net so you can strap down all your gear right here so it doesn't fly around in transit. And then also a cargo door, cargo net right here as well. That way, you know, when you open the door, things aren't falling out on top of you. Always a nice feature. We've got a little carpet action going on right here. So grab bars coming in and out. All right, let's check out the mill. There we go. This is... Got the, as I mentioned earlier, 8.3 liter Cummins. Love these, man. LED clearance lights up top. LED brake lights, or no, LED turn signals and backup lights, but regular brake lights. All right, look at that. See it? How about it? 8.3. Well, you can't read the deck on tag, but. <laughs> Pardon me. 8.3 liter Cummins. Allison Automatic. Mm. That's a hard combo to beat, you know? It really is. As I mentioned, new exterior paint, exhaust pipe poking out the top up there. Kind of, man, that's reminiscent of a transit bus. So, all right. Check out the tire tread here on this side. See that there? Looking good. Inside here, battery box. There we go. Look at that couple of 8Ds right there. How about it? Master switch. Also, uh, fuel right here, fuel door. Looks like a locking gas cap. Stainless steel wheel covers. Also, good tire tread. Just got a pile of tread on her all the way around. Let's check out this J box. How about it? Look at that. A little schematic up there. Yep, looking good, looking good. So this would work awesome for like a team bus, you know, something like that. After school, private school, you know, team bus. LED clearance lights up top, church bus. I'm going long hauls with this baby and lots of room for luggage. So check us out online, nwbus.com. Please call with any questions, 800-231-7099. Thanks.